Hello, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Chloe and I sell things online to earn a living. Today's video is, you guessed it, another thrift plus haul. Um, I've done quite a lot of these recently. If you are new to my channel, I've not long had a baby, so getting out and going sourcing is a little more difficult than it used to be. He's currently eight weeks old and I have been to a charity shop like once since he was born. I have got major withdrawals but here we are. Um, so I am doing a lot of sourcing online and one of those places is Thrift Plus. And I have got the bag here. Oh, it's massive. I haven't even opened it yet. Um, they had a big 50% off sale. Oh, like I wanna say, like, well, when you're watching this, it's probably been weeks, to be honest. I don't know when this video will go up, but they had a big sale. So I had to get involved and I got a few decent pieces. Nothing outstanding, I don't think, but there's some decent pieces in there. Right, I've opened the bag off camera because it's really loud and we'll just dive straight in. It's all like folded up, but I don't know whether it's gonna be a little bit creased, but we'll, f we'll figure it out. Okay, first item, something denim. I actually cannot remember what I've ordered. Uh, this is Anthropology, size 16. Oh, it's Pilkro. It's a Pilkro denim skirt, new with tags. Mainly buy things new with tags off Thrift Plus, but not all the time. Um, I just trust the new with tags a little better. So just a basic little denim skirt. I will put the cost of goods on the screen. I'll put it here now um, because I can't remember. I want to say it was around about... It would be around about £4 or four, but it might be a bit more. Between 4 and 5 Um but yeah, we've got a little denim skirt by Pilkrow Anthropology, and that's a size 16. Original price was, Jesus, £80, £80. I know Pilkrow is like decent. Let me show you the label. Used to be Pilkrow in the letterpress, and it's now just Pilkrow. Um, it's a decent brand, especially for denim, but 80 quid. No, no thank you. This is more denim um these ones might be you know put in the summer box for next year because they are cream denim jeans they are a straight leg oh they're nice actually with a little turn up uh they're long tall sally and they're new with tags again long tall sally in a size 16 again easy fit turn ups in ecru there you go long tall sally they'll probably go in i've started a not a summer box, but I started a bag of more like spring summer items. Not necessarily to, it's not that I won't list them. They're just not going to be my priority at the minute. If I run low on stock and I need to list them, then I'll list them because people go on holiday. They need all kinds of clothing all year round. And when they can't find it in the shops, they will, they will look online. So your summer stuff is still going to sell, but I've, it's just put away to one side and it's not, I'm not prioritising it at the minute. Got some velvet. Oh, just a cute little top with lace on the top. And then like black velour on the bottom. I don't know how well that's going to show up. Who is that by? No idea. Oh, it's Sandro, size one. Uh, not new with tags. Like I say, there's some pieces that I picked up that weren't. There you go. Sandro in a size one. It's nice though. And for this time of year like anything velvet it sells really quickly for me this is nice but again i'm not sure if it's great for this time of year it's really pretty but it's very very summery but that's okay i can put it to one side and it's very creased as well it's like a little shift dress and it's ganny there you go a ganny shift dress and it's it's a beautiful colour. It's like a peachy colour. I don't know if it's coming up on screen very well as to what colour it is. It is in a size extra small, but it's very oversized, so yeah, that had almost fit me. And I'm like a 16, so it's very oversized. But I don't know how well that'll do. I don't sell ganny because it's I don't find it in my area. My area is not a very affluent town, so we don't find stuff like that very often. These are so cool, and if they were my size, I would keep them. They're in a size small, though. They are, they're like, they're jeans material, like, or like thick cotton trousers. But look at them. They're like a wide leg, brown check. They're by You Must Create, which I think is technically YMC now. 
Um, so I think this is an older label. But I just thought style, some, I think they're really cool. They're in a size small though. Otherwise they would not be leaving my wardrobe because I absolutely love those. With like a black roll neck jumper. Absolutely beautiful for winter. This is also very nice. Don't buy a huge amount of hush anymore, but the price, it was worth it. Um, it's a khaki green leopard print blouse, newer tags. That's in a size 10. Again, the colour is just really good for this time of year. But I try not to buy as much hush because it's just tanked quite a lot. But if it's new tags. And I also try not to buy size 10. Uh, but again, it was new tags. This is Brora. It's a skirt. It's not like... For Brora, you want the material. You want the good material. Brora cashmere is what you really want. Uh, but it was cheap, so I thought I'd grab it. I think this might be... Mm, actually, no, you can wear it with tights. I was going to say I might put it in the summer box. But the colour, you can wear it. You can wear it this time of year. Um, it's in a size 12. There you go. A Brora size 12. I don't think there's anything special about the material no it's just viscose so no silk just viscose but i reckon it'll do okay i think i'll probably list that sooner rather than later we've got some more denim these are not your daughter's jeans which always sell well for me especially in a good size and these are in a good size they're in a us 14 which is like a, what a uk 18 i want to say and the new tags i think these were one of the higher priced items i think they came to like I think these were about £10, but um, I average it out. I average out my cost, so I will... It, it just makes it easier for me. I don't individualise it. But, yeah, these were the Alina. The Alina legging, it says. They're like denim. Uh, not your daughter's. With their tag. Do they have a price on? Just out of interest. No, they've got no price on them. It's been ripped off the bottom, I think. They're just a grey like straight leg jean and they always always sell pretty well for me usually i can get about 20 pounds for not your daughter's jeans obviously these are new and they are in a really good size so i'll probably stick them up for like 30 maybe a bit more maybe even 35 and just see see if i get any interest in them oh this is diane von furstenberg again not new with tags we've got quite a few that are used this time around which is unlike me for thrift plus but i just thought i'd give them give it another go Diane von Verstenberg vintage. Um, it's just a really cute little wrap top. The wrap dresses are what you want from that brand, but I'd really like the print of it. It's got a collar. It's in a size six, but that's a US size six. Oh, it's 100% silk. I didn't even realize that. 100% silk, even better. Um, US size six, so a UK 10. Not ideal, but I just really liked, there's a print, look. I really like the print. I've got more hush. Not picking it up, but I got more. Uh, it's newer tags again. Size 8. Not ideal again, but, you know. When it was this cheap, it was worth it. It's just a black wrap dress. Very simple, but very... Oh, it's got a nice ruffle down the front, look. Very simple, but very... Um, popular? Popular. <laughs> very popular. Probably shouldn't have picked this one up. Uh, this is mint velvet, but it's the furry label. If you know, you know. If you don't, I'll show you. <laughs> the mint velvet furry label, like the old one, in a size 12. Brand new tags though, which is why I picked it up. Um, it was originally £119. Mint velvet is so expensive, no. It's a lacy, just like a lacy, come on, dress. There we go. Short sleeve, cream lace dress, little mini, mini dress with a scalloped edge. It's really quite nice, actually. And I thought it might be good for, like, Christmas parties. Like, some people don't like sparkles and bright colours and, like, over-the-top festive. And I thought that was quite nice. This one is definitely going to go in the summer bag. Because I, by the feel of it, it feels like linen. If not, it's cotton. I can never tell. <laughs> I'm useless. It's cars, though. And it's, like, a newer label cars. Brand new tags again. Oh, it's hemp. That's why I couldn't tell. Um, it's in a pale blue. Very creased. But you you can see. It's a collarless, like, granddad collar shirt. It's in a medium, and it says medium regular. It might be men's. I'll have to measure it and see. But obviously, it was in the women's section. But that is going to go and be put aside for summer. Another piece of Brora, and this is a Liberty Print 
Brora, which is why I picked this one up. This is a Brora jersey dress, and jersey dresses, I mean, I'll pick them up, but they're not going to get, you're not going to get as much for them. That's in a size 12 as well. Um, but this print is Liberty. I did a screenshot and then Google Photos. Is it Google Photo Search? Um, but it's gorgeous, look. Really nice. Um, but yeah, size 12. I don't know why I keep saying erm. Um. Sorry about that. I need to get back into the habit of filming videos and not erming um all the time. But it's nice. It's very nice. I'm just going to check if it's been taken up because it's quite short. No, nope, it's just quite a short dress. Not been taken up. This is Maasai. It's like a... Na yeah navy and cream stripe dress i want to say yeah that's a dress that's not a tunic very stretchy i think it's in a small size but mass size always oversized it's in a yeah size small not new with tags just used i'm not sure why i picked that up though because mass size does not go for me unless it's in bigger sizes i think i was just getting a little bit giddy just grabbing everything so i thought oh my god 50 percent off couldn't help myself Yet another piece of Brora in a size 12. It must have all been, like, donated by the same person. Because you send your stuff in to Thrift Plus. I don't even know whether it's you donate it. You send it in and maybe they, like, it's kind of like consignment. You might get credit or something. I'm not 100% sure. I've actually got some bags ready to fill up and send off myself. But I just never got around to doing it. Anyway, this is Brora again, size 12. This one's a jersey skirt. It's like an animal print. Um, that one I will list, that's a midi, I will list that one 100% because it's like a nice, comfortable, dark coloured jersey skirt that I think it's like a nice work skirt. More cos, newer tags cos, but older label, in a size large, this was originally £45, um, it's a skirt, just a black skirt with, I want to say pink, yeah it's a really pale pink, it looks white on camera, really pale pink trim at the bottom with an elasticated waist. Oh, that'd be really stretchy. That goes, that'd fit me. And I would have thought I'd be an XL in cos, but that fits me. That's very stretchy. Not sure if it's got any nice, oh, it's got pockets. Woo, love, love anything with pockets. Not sure if it's got any nice material in it. It doesn't feel like it. It just feels like jersey. Yeah, it's just cotton and elastane, but it's very nice. This is Philip Lim. 3.1 Philip Lim to be precise. There you go. I've never had this brand before, so I thought I'd just give it a go. It's just a, like a navy. Oh, what is that? What is that? Oh, it's a bit fluff. It's like a navy sleeveless top. Really nice. It's like ribbed with a really nice hem. Um, you can't really see the colour on camera very well. No idea whether it's going to go for a decent amount, but I thought I'd give it a try because I've never had it before. Uh, the trim is silk, it's viscose polyester. What size are you? It doesn't actually have a size on it anywhere. It's a medium, there we go. It is a medium. But yeah. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> it's uh, pretty nice. And I think it'd be really nice for work with a nice pair of trousers. These are just a bit of bread and butter. These are Adidas leggings. Um, they are new tags in a size 8 to 10 so i think they're like a small i think they're a size small uh, they're just camo adidas leggings and the bottom are black and then they've got adidas on the bottom of them for the price that i was getting them at it's not long before it's going to be exercise time <laughs> new year and everyone starts exercising so it's good to have that kind of stuff in your shop this is quite nice but it's not showing i can't really hold it up nicely um hopefully it photographs nicely it's karen millen and it's like a collared cream long sleeve dress but it, like it's ruches i might need to put that on the mannequin like you see the side of it it's really flattering and the sleeves do as well and it's stretchy midi length by the look of it in a size 12 and that is also newer tags 140 pounds karen millen is wild how expensive it is retail but then doesn't resell amazingly. I don't really pick it up unless it's in a good size. It's like a recent style or if it's new tags. Um, I'm a bit more picky with Karen Millen. This is Chinty and Parker. I'll show you the tag. Size small. I just thought the print was really nice. It's just a long sleeve top. There's nothing super special about it. I just like the print. I thought it was quite nice. Um, it's not new tags. No, it's used. But it's in very nice condition by the feel of it. 
this is white stuff and i don't pick white stuff up anymore but new tags and the print is really cute it's proper like autumnal purple and brown flowers size 14 so a good size originally 40 quid it's like a tunic i think that will sell pretty well because it could be giftable as well it might be a dress actually mm, tunic yeah stuff like this could be giftable so it's good to have lots of new tag stuff in your store going into q4 i think it's difficult with clothing like trying to prep for q4 obviously you want weather appropriate stuff party appropriate stuff but also getting stuff new with tags that can be giftable so obviously clothing is a bit more it's not as giftable because you don't know what somebody likes or what style or what fit they want but sometimes having new tag stuff it is worth it this is another karen millen party dress or formal dress I'm just trying to get it hold it upright so i can show you it's black but it's got lace cut out so it just makes it a little bit different the sleeves are lace and it's got like a lace cut out around the waist which you can't really see there you go and it's got a lace trim it's like a pencil yeah, like a pencil midi oh it's got lace all down the front as well and on the bottom it is newer tags like i said in a size oh just says size medium but again i thought christmas parties that is beautiful absolutely a beautiful this is just another pair of adidas leggings again 12 sorry uk size 12 they've only got 11 pounds on the tag they were reduced from 25 pounds so Probably not the best pickup, but because they were newer tags, grey leggings, I just thought, again, for exercise season. I never ever find this brand. This is a Claudie Perlo. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly. Apologies if I'm not. In a size 40, it's a really nice khaki green blouse with a tie neck and then like a cutout. It's, it feels like silk. It's three quarter sleeve. I'm going to check the material but it feels silky no it's 100 percent polyester I told you I, earlier i don't have i don't have the touch I can't just tell what something is by feeling it and then our final item is more cars not new with tags this time though this is just a navy is it navy yeah a navy top that's it there's nothing very exciting about it long sleeve it's got this weird a weird bit on the back where it just like halfway down it just fastens in the middle with little clasps uh, i don't know what that's all about i'm not sure i'll have to see what it looks like hung up but it's in a size large it is used but it's newer newer label cars it's it's a bit funky but yeah look on the back halfway down it's got those little i don't know a bit strange didn't notice that on the photo but she probably still would have picked it up anyway that is oh it's not wait one more one more it was hiding and this is hatch this is a maternity brand hatch maternity blouse a very expensive maternity brand the only reason i know about this is resold by lou on instagram she told me she messaged me when i was pregnant and told me that thrift plus had a nice hatch dress in sale maternity dress and i looked it up and i was like wow i didn't know about that so i have lou to thank for that but yeah this is a maternity blouse I don't know if it's a feeding, like a nursing blouse. I'm not sure. I don't know. I can't tell. But anyway, Hatch is a, a good maternity brand. It's one to look out for. And I think that is it this time. Yeah, there's nothing else in that bag. That is everything. So, yeah. Did you like anything? everything that I picked up? Did you think that I picked up a decent amount of stuff? I think this time round... I tried not to pick up all the bread and butter stuff that I usually get, like Zara and New Look and River Island, because I've got a lot of that at the moment. I wanted something a little bit, like a few different brands. I'm happy with what I've got. As I said at the beginning, the price was on the screen. If you missed it, I'll put it here again. Um, I cannot remember for the life of me, somewhere between four and five pounds, but I can't remember. And I'm going to go and get it all listed. I now need to photograph it, steam it and photograph it. And hopefully start selling it if you did enjoy the video as always don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video bye everyone